Hi, I'm Felicity, and today we're going to be looking at number bonds and exploring this using the part-part-whole model. Number bonds show children how numbers can be broken down. So, here is our part-part-whole model. We have five, which is the whole, and it's been broken down into two parts, in this case, three and two. Now, it's really important to introduce this concept using concrete resources to really develop the children's understanding. So here I've got counters. You can be more inventive than this, but I've got two here and three here. Two parts which equal a total of five. Now, once they're confident using their concrete resources, we can move on to representing their work pictorially using that part-part-whole model. So here I've got eight to represent the whole, and we've got two bubbles in which the two parts are going to be represented. So say I've got two, in the top one. That means we'd have to have six to equal the whole of eight. Now, once the children are confident doing this, using this part-part-whole model, we can represent the working in an abstract way with the calculation two plus six, which equals eight. Furthermore, this part-part-whole model can be used to partition tens and ones. So here we've got 17 as the whole in this bubble. We can partition that into 110. So I'll write that up here. And then we've got seven ones, which I can write down here. This can then be written as the calculation 10 plus seven equals 17, which is the whole. And that's how you use the part-part-whole model to explore number bonds.